the freedom feeling with skiing, the camaraderie that comes along with the world of skiing, the fun they had, the sporty attitude they had, the health that kind of beamed out of them. That was the kind of life that I wanted to have. Here's Norway's Stein Eriksson, a brilliant racer. He responds by displaying flawless form down the tricky Olympic slalom course. Ericsson flashes down the course in a beautiful, thrilling ski performance. Slow motion emphasizes the grace of the great Ericsson. Stein Ericsson is champion in the men's giant slalom. Gold medal winner, world champion, Mr. Stein Ericsson. He was uh, part of that early ski boom. Stein was part of that that new wave of, uh, of new ski industry people in this country. He kind of represented the ideal mix of an athlete and a movie star. He thought that uh, Stein was uh, not only good looking and made very good time with the girls, but he was uh, a fantastic skier and he was better than anybody in this country. He emphasized a totally different technique. Stein started something different that looked much more stylish. Stein made it look like so much fun. I mean, he was so graceful. He was the perfect technique. He could ski on anything. Uh, he could ski at 90 miles an hour without a hat when it was 40 below zero and make it look easy. <laughs> to do flips on 215 centimeter skis. You know, we built a jump and I took off and all of a sudden I found myself in the layout position. And then finally when I felt I was dropping, I tucked and I landed on my skis. Since then, I never did the tuck right away. I always did the layout. And every Sunday, wherever I was, in the winter time, at one o'clock, Stein was gonna do his flip. I remember seeing him that first time in 1960 in Aspen and did a flip in front of the people eating lunch uh, up on the mountain in Aspen. I'd never seen anything like that. Uh, I thought that he invented freestyle skiing. He was a very glamorous a symbol of skiing. He made it exciting. Stein was always great in front of people. It, it made no difference if it were one to two people or a large crowd or a talk in front of a ski club or just skiing at Deer Valley. Stein is probably the most beautiful skier, definitely the most stylish skier. His skiing was so smooth and he flowed so easily between turns with such grace and elegance, and everyone said, that's the way I want to ski. There are still people around that love the way that Stein skis. It was a way of life for me. When I was born, skiing was my life.